defender up quick on that one. Ball is there for Glasgow. Oh, there's Nick Gregg. Unbelievable break. He's two defenders. He's got Matawalu coming on his left shoulder. Matawalu is away. He's been chased down by Dirksen, but Dirksen is not going to get close to Matawalu. Try number two, and Glasgow are in again. Well, I mentioned at the start, beware of your kicking game against a Dave Rennie team. And this is one for the youngsters at home in support lines, a 2v2 situation. And that man there, Nico Matawalu, read it superbly. It's great that there's all the damage. Tom Shankin highlighted him before the game started. Good tackle by Keelan Giles following up. I thought he turned the Glasgow player, but out it came on the Glasgow side. It's seemingly slow, but Grigg identifies Mafu Fia. It's a mismatch. He goes at him. He's through. Watch Matawala. He's on his right, but he scans in front of him. Both Ospreys defenders go for Grigg. He moves to the left in the space. What a try from the Fijian. All good, man. Brilliant stuff from Glasgow, and it's an easy one for Brandon Thompson, his easiest of the night. It's been a torrid start for Thier in their tight head shirt okay. for Ospreys, hasn't it? Unfortunately, for him, we'll looking for that. I don't know if they're targeting yeah, him, but the but skill set that ball, Glasgow have got with their ball in hands, their ability to break that line, and you just see they look so comfortable, don't they? We mentioned Matawala's line there. He could have stayed out on the wing, but he knows where the try line is, doesn't he, that man? That one was all about Nick Grigg, though, wasn't it? Yeah, you know the former...